Welcome to Starbase Pink. This is your daily space and SpaceX news. Today, Soyuz 2.1A rocket launched Karin, cosmonaut Oleg Konenenko and Nikolai Chubb and NASA's astronaut Laura O'Hara. By the time you see this video, they will be docked to the International Space Station. They need just 3 hours and 11 minutes. This is liftoff. NASA's James Webb Space Telescope captured this amazing image of a newborn star with supersonic jets of gas spewing from its pores. According to NASA, this newborn star is a few tens of thousands of years old. And talking about amazing pictures, Greg Scott captured these aerial pictures. Here we can see three tower sections being built at SpaceX Roberts Road facility will be transported later to Space Launch Complex 40. And at Space Launch Complex 40, you can see SpaceX crew tower building progress will be used for future crewed Falcon 9 launches, so they can use 39A to launch Starship. I put Greg Scott link in the description, make sure to check it out for more pictures and content. Firefly Aerospace successfully launched its third Alpha rocket following 24-hour notice from the US Space Force Space Systems Command to complete final pilot operations and mission preparations. They successfully deployed the Victus Knox spacecraft. We have an update from Firefly Aerospace. We did it y'all, today was an incredible success for the Space Force, the Firefly team and our nation after nailing the Victus Knox responsive space mission, we launched our Alpha rocket and deployed the satellite at the target destination following 24 hour notice. Let's end this video with this amazing video shared by Sierra Space, we can see Dream Chaser space planes rather swinging through its full 60 degree rotation. This rudder will provide stability during re-entry, just to mention that this test was performed in January, so if Sierra Space Team are performing some tests right now, we will see the footage in the middle of next year in about 9 months. That's it for now, this is the end of this episode, see you tomorrow.